We're ecstatic to be building a brand new multi-purpose recreation facility attached to Coaldale's brand spanking new high school. So when the opportunity came for the uh, to partner with the town on a new project, not only a school but a rec centre, it, uh, it was a, an obvious manoeuvre for us to sit up down and converse and uh, see if we can come up with a plan. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity for Coaldale and collaboratively both uh, entities work very hard to make it happen. As a council we identified from the beginning that we want a community involvement from the outset of this project. We formed that group of interested community members and they along with staff and council had the opportunity to analyze the community needs. We came up with the idea for the recreation facility at the working group uh, because we investigated our current facilities here in Coaldale and we also got out on the road and we had a look at different facilities in similar sized towns with similar needs. What the Sport and Rec Working Group did is they are experts and uh, engaged citizens and they, they know what is needed in the community and uh, they clearly saw a need for uh, indoor field space. There is a size crunch in, in Coldell. It's a growing community. We've started to outgrow all of our existing schools. We're looking at great configuration changes. We're doing everything we can, but we need a physical space to do that. The upfront capital costs projected for this facility are about $13 million, but that includes significant space that will be leased back to local businesses who are excited to see the tremendous potential this new space has. In the new facility, we're looking to provide a lot more equipment. We'll be expanding the weight room by about two times. Uh, we are also going to be expanding our group class schedule as where our classroom will be much bigger. Um, as, as well as that, we're going to have access to the track and uh, 1,500 square feet of turf area as well. Having lease space also contributes positively to keeping long-term costs down. Our very conservative forecast for this facility shows an operating surplus, which is quite rare for municipally run facilities. That's great news because it means the facility won't have any impact on the property tax in town, which is always ideal. Moving into this new facility is really gonna elevate the level of services we can give by upping the convenience factor for families. By having everything in one facility that's open year round, it's really going to open up um, opportunities for families to do things together. Having Twisted Still Fitness and the future daycare provider involved with this project allowed the space to be bigger, something that Cold Out can grow into for years to come. Through the Sport and Rec Working Group and Town Administration, we were able to uh, find those partners, those partnership opportunities, give facility the ability to be larger than it would have been otherwise. Some of the key elements we wanted to capture in the, the design of the building was to create a facility that would be um, accessible for all the public in Coaldale, from toddlers right up to um, seniors. It's really important to recognize that over the years we've had great partners with all of our communities. In Coaldale itself, it would be the time we spent working on the fire academy. You could also look at the work that we're doing with uh, the local colleges coming in and supporting some of our trades and some of the work that we're doing in the school and the, in the shop areas. This new high school will stand out because it is directly attached or alongside with the rec centre. But we also will be reconfiguring our grade so it'll be 7 to 12 which is new to Coldale. So it will look different than what we've had in the past, but with having those grades together, uh, we may be able to offer more programs as well. The new rec centre will become a gathering space for the community. I think it's important for families and the youth of our community to gain access to community programs through the rec centre. So the location of this school, having it be so close to um, the Birds of Prey and the wetlands will definitely offer some programming as well and with the um, walking paths that will be there, the community and rural community can also access that and we can provide some more opportunities for our students uh, just being in that location. This is going to be a very special high school and, and really that rec centre tie-in is going to be amazing. But also what we're designing inside the school is going to be special. We did a lot of work with our, our students, our staff and parents in this area. We started talking about what is it that's going to be special for you? What is it that we need to make this a school that your kids want to come to? 
And really what came out is we need a good gymnasium space, but we also want a good space for career and technology studies. We wanted the space that could do drama, so we built and planned a drama theatre inside it. So we've got lots of uh, ideas as to how this is going to be very special. But to be honest, it's just the, the strength of that partnership with the community that's going to make this the biggest uh, win for everybody.